Hey, my name is Courtney Holyfield. I'm a student in ADM 310 at the University of South Alabama. Today, I'll be reading the story, I Can Move to a Group of My K-3 Kids at West Mobile Baptist Child Development Center. Okay, I'm going to read, I Can Move. When I was born, I was very little. I could kick my feet and move my arms, but I couldn't even sit up. I had to be carried everywhere. <coughs> As I grew, my bones and muscles got bigger and stronger, and soon I could move around all on my own. Mm-hmm, she did. I can move in lots of different ways now. I can skip, run, jump, roll, and dance. I can do all these things because I have a skeleton inside my body. If I didn't have one, I wouldn't be able to stand up. I'd be all floppy. Our skeletons are made up of lots of different bones, big bones and small bones, all joined together. Bones are very hard and very strong. They don't bend easily. Mm -hmm. Dinosaurs have lots of bones in their body. Mm -hmm. But we need to bend to move. It is the jointed parts of our skeletons that move. My knees and elbows bend where two bones join together. So do my fingers and my toes. Huh? Mm -hmm. So do my fingers and my toes. Now listen to the story. Okay, listen to the story. This is, listen, Caitlin, this is my dad bone. It's, it's really lots of small bones joined together, so it bends. My backbone goes all the way from my head down to my back to my bottom. Caitlin, listen to the story. Muscles make my bones move. They are like big stretchy rubber bands attached to the bones. My muscles pull the bones up and down when I move. Lots of animals have skeletons as we do. This is my dog, Jess. This is my goldfish, Jaws. Birds have skeletons, too. Oh, All the bones? There's lots of them. I got bones in me. You have bones all over your body. I got some in me. The end. Hey, I got That's all. Bones in my book. Card.